Right, hi guys, it's Bob from Greybeard Models again. Nice to see you all. Thought I'd do a quick catch up and I've got a few uh, models to add to the stash. So we'll go through that in a bit. Um, just like to say, I haven't really made a lot of progress on, on models recently. The weather here in the UK has been really good. Uh, it's been great just being able to sit outside in the garden and watch stuff going on or, you know, going out and about, sitting in the countryside um and just doing other stuff so the progress on the models has been slow uh, i've done a little bit but not a lot but i've got while that's been going on got a few more things to add to the stash so i'm just going to get those together and uh, show you what we've got okay so the the first thing to add to the stash was this uh, gaz triple a with shelter this is another mini art uh, gas truck obviously if you've been following my channel you know i've got a few of these now this one actually piqued my interest because just like the idea of this this truck looks like it's got someone's outhouse on the back someone's shed um, this is kit number 35183 um, and the difference between this and the other ones that i've got is this has got the twin rear axle um, so again this is slightly different but uh, yeah quite like this typical mini art box um, yeah, the alternative markings are to make it as an ambulance uh, which was used by the Russians I believe but um, yeah I just thought I just thought yeah I just love the, the, the artwork on the on the box as well I just thought yeah it looks really good and and these gas trucks by Mini Art, they go together really, really well. So that's the first thing on the, on the stash. Next one, uh, I've got a, a few kits that I've, I've sort of always wanted to get and then never bothered or, or not not got them for whatever reason. And the next one's um, this one by Tamiar. It's the Yamaha XV1000 Virago with a touring rider. This has been out for a huge number of years. Um, I don't know. I can't remember when it was first, when it first came out, but it was one of those kits that I, I often saw and thought, "Oh, I should get that." No, I won't. Uh, yes, I will. No, I won't. But this one came up on uh, on eBay for a bargain price. Um, I think probably it's got a little bit sort of old school, but I quite like that. Um, and it's um, a one twelve scale Yamaha V twin. Those of you who are a certain age will remember these bikes back in the day. Um, and I just quite like the idea of uh, why not let's, let's do, let's have this in the stash and I'll one day get round to it. But uh, that's that one. Um, this, one I, this one I picked up the other day. This is an, another old uh, uh, Tammy R kit. It's Morris Mini Cooper Racing. Car. these were very very big in the sort of rally circuits that sort of thing um, so and I, I quite like this one uh, and it's 124 scale very very straightforward mini anybody that knows minis anybody that knows British cars will know minis um, but yeah straightforward little kit I think um, it's got racing wheels and, and it's got the, the flared arches on it and um, you know racing steering wheel racing bucket seats that sort of thing so I thought that would be a great fun fun one to build so added that to the stash and last but not least this little baby this is a uh, another Tammy R kit a Morgan 4x4 um, 124 scale um, opening bonnet it's got engine detail um, really good uh, looking car these are great cars love these cars anyway this is an official product it's it's got the Morgan logo on it um, I ha I've had a look through this one it's actually got a photo etch uh, badge on the on the bonnet here or the hood and it's got the Morgan logo that goes over the top of that as well it's got the strap that goes over the bonnet you know it's got all that old British racing car heritage stuff going on um, 
uh, two colour schemes it offers but of course it's, it's got to be British Racing Green um, just a, a, a you know wicked kit that I wanted to get hold of and again this one came up on on eBay with a bit of a bargain price um, so I'm quite happy with that and uh, hopefully get, I'll get back into 124 scale cars at some point and uh, this will probably be the first one on the hit list to build but uh, that's, that's all I've got to add for the moment um, I'll get back to uh, the the tow truck that's that's in in progress at the moment I'm just waiting for some paint to dry um, and then I'll get an update video on that and uh, obviously I've got the garage ruin sorted out that's got a bit of progress on it so I, I can do a read I'll, I'll give you an update on that but uh, that's all I've got for today hope you've all had a great Sunday it's been a busy day here in the UK it's the last day of the Premier League football season and all the big teams have been playing so everybody's been pretty much glued to watching the, the TVs and watching watching the football um, or soccer as you call it in the US uh, but it's been yeah been a chilled out day been sat here sat in the garden reading books and just chilling out having a cold drink and all that so I hope you've all had a good weekend I hope you've got a good week coming up for you and uh, hopefully see you soon Take care out there. Have a good day. Bye for now.